of the people and welcome to Paris where I am currently in a train station in a very fancy tunnel looking for my train because I am going to Lollapalooza Paris today to see Bitty Cairo and the 1975. I've actually been here for a couple of days, that's a separate vlog but I'm vlogging today as its own thing because otherwise they were going to be too long together. I think my other vlog is already at like 20 to 30 minutes so I thought I'd separate them. But yeah, I'm just on my way now but I can't find my train and this is the only time I've actually been lost so far like it's so easy to get around but there is an MS in front of me so I may get some fuzzy pics for the day also uh, apologies if my fringe looks really weird I have sprayed the living fuck out of it with hairspray so it doesn't go all flicky uh, which I can see it's doing already the perils of having a fringe when you have naturally curly hair that does not want to stay straight also in this heat it won't my arm's hurting now I'm getting blog on so I am going to go and look for my train found my train this is gripping content I'm sure but I'm in the right place heading towards the right place so all good you can see but we're getting close I don't think you can I think you can just see the portal lose I made it I'm here in one piece there is just no like excusing the fringe it's just gonna be mad and I need to be okay with it but first things first it's a cashless festival so I need to go and buy a wristband so I can actually pay for things and then once I've done that I'm going to go and buy a t-shirt because that is what I do at festivals it's not as massive as I thought it was gonna be but it's so 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 cool I got my bitly t-shirt this is the one I was looking at in Isle of Wight and didn't get but I'm very happy I've got it now Although now I've got four overalls, that's maybe too many. I'm gonna go and watch some music. Mum just called me and I've just left the alternative station to talk to her and unwittingly walked straight into the path of a sprinkler and got shot straight in the face. It was hilarious. There's a band on at the moment and I don't know who they are but I'm really enjoying them. The lead singer is really cool and has a very Amy Winehouse vibe to her voice and the guitarist is the coolest woman I've ever seen so I want to find out who they are because she is gold. Serious gold. I just paid 25 euros to find out that I am unequivocally not a hat person. Uh, I'm gonna keep it. There's a nice memento, uh, but it's not a good look on me at all. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, guys, I'm not a hat person. This whole vibe is like a festival dad, and not in a good way. This is just bad. Shame. Uh, I think I'd rather get sunstroke. <laughs> anyway. I'm walking over towards Tudor in the line, they've just come out on the main stage. And uh, so far they sound pretty cool. and I have cooled off and I feel so much better so that's my game plan 
if I get all like, ugh, I'm gonna go back and stand there. I'm having such a good time, especially now I've cooled down a bit. I've done my best to uh, fix the situation. I've gone for the very 90s sort of hair slide, uh, fringe to the side kind of vibe. Uh, it's bad, really bad. Anyway, I'm having a really good time. I think that was great. Judah and the line were excellent. I'm now hiding in the chain.
that right? Well, please, it does that right now. Favorite, favorite, favorite fucking bird. I loved every second of it. I was so close. I was close enough to catch stuff when they threw it, but no one threw anything at me, so I didn't catch it. But I've got mad hair now. I'm all sweaty and I'm hot and I'm dying for a drink. But oh my god, do you know what I'm doing first though before I get a drink? I'm going to the fresh zone because I need to cool off. In my hair back again, it was so bad. Uh, I'm just queuing up for a burrito at the moment. In all honesty, I don't want one, but I have got 24 pounds left on my bracelet because it's cashless, I'm just showing you. So I've got 24 euros left and I need to spend it. So if I don't eat, then I lose out on 25 quid basically because the euro is one to one at the moment, pretty much. Uh, so I'm getting a burrito because I love Mexican food. How do you say no coriander in French? in a while so if I forget the I'm lyrics I fucking love it <laughs> I forget the lyrics rock and roll If you're wondering um, why I look particularly ghostly, it's because I've got an Elemis face mask on. It's the um, veggie, vital veggie mask. I just thought my skin could do with a little boost after today. My eyes are so red. I'm just packing, I'm watching Moulin Rouge. And that is my alarm going off to say I need to wash the mask off. I'm also thinking about having some Percy pigs. Yeah, I'm gonna go wash this off, I'll be back. Hello, so I'm back. Uh, having washed the mask off. My eyes are so red, but I haven't had hay fever here. How strange. Just packing up. Uh, I don't know what time I have to check out of here tomorrow, but I thought if I could get as much done as I can tonight, then I can probably sleep a bit later tomorrow. It's only half 11 as well, so which is half 10 at home, I think. So I'm not even particularly tired yet. Well, I am. I'm, I'm physically tired, but like mentally I'm buzzing. So uh, I actually just wanted to quickly jump on it and just tell you how amazing the 1975 were. I've had such a good day. I know I've moaned a lot. I know my hair has been a real problem. Like this still is a problem. I look like a scarecrow. 
but I can't be bothered to wash it. I'm gonna wash it in the morning. Anyway, I'm just packing up now. I had the best day. I just, I really thoroughly enjoyed it. I had such a good time. I've loved being in Paris. I have vlogged my trip as well. That'll be a different vlog. I've just had the best time. It's been really nice. I've only been here since Friday. Here's Sunday. I've packed so much in. Like, I'll show you that in the other vlog, but like I got here and went straight to the Sacre Coeur. I've seen the Moulin Rouge multiple times because it's literally on the next road. I have just done so much stuff it's been really good and this clip is now like three minutes long so i'm gonna stop and say good night and thank you for coming with me to Lollapalooza. i had a great time i hope you've enjoyed this vlog if you want to see more festival content from me please let me know although we're coming to the end of festival season now if you like this video please like it subscribe all that jazz and don't forget to ring the bell and i will see you in the next video bye